Hey, what is up guys, Colossnex here, and today we're gonna to talk about how to build up some good grip strength. And I'm gonna teach you the real way, not the sitting at the edge of a bench doing 1,000 wrist curls way. So grip comes from all the muscles in our forearms. So it's not actually, when you look at your hand, it's not just your fingers that are you know, contracting and extending. Every time you contract and extend, and if you look in the video here, you can see that there's all these different little muscles in the forearm that are firing every single time that I make a fist. You could probably see the same thing on your own arm. Every time you flex, every time you squeeze as hard as you can, you see your forearm start to swell. You can see movement in there. You can see all the little muscles that are working, all the tendons that are firing to make that grip happen. That being said, you wanna do exercises that are gonna stimulate and challenge those muscles in your forearm as much as possible. We wanna challenge the grip as much as possible. So that doesn't mean doing, you know, a ton of wrist curls because that's what most people seem to believe at the end of their workout. They're sitting there and they're doing a ton of wrist curls because they think if they tire out their wrists, they're challenging their grip. But uh, it, it doesn't really work that way. Your grip is challenged any time that you have to hold something for a long time. You know, it's, it's actually really a lot simpler than people think. The more you challenge your grip with heavier and heavier things, the more your grip will improve. You hear about things like old man strength and that's like it's true you know because as you grow older right you just hold a lot of stuff over the course of your life and by the time you've hit you know your 40s and 50s you've got incredible grip strength because you have all those years of gripping but anyway you came here for exercises so let's talk exercises so if you want to improve your grip strength basically you want to do anything that is going to just challenge your grip so that means heavy objects, it means any kind of exercise where you're kind of holding on for dear life. When you have to grip and you're resisting gravity, I find that pull exercises challenge that the most. So you're doing things like rows, you're doing things like deadlifts, you're doing things like pull-ups. You know, these are all really good examples because you have to hold something and you're working against gravity to pull said object up or pull said object down. Your fingers have to work, your forearm muscles have to work really hard to maintain that squeeze when you're pulling something when you're pushing something like on a bench press or an overhead press you don't have to squeeze as hard because you're pushing the weight away from you you're not pulling it once that pull happens your fingers want to uncurl right when you're doing a heavy deadlift you know that your fingers want to uncurl and sometimes it takes everything in you just to keep your fingers curled tight around the bar that's why we have things like you know lifting straps to help with the grip because once you're pulling things down and away from you or towards you your fingers want to let go so anytime that you're doing an exercise where your fingers want to let go so things like bicep curls or tricep pull down you know things where you have to really grip something or the exercise won't work those are the exercises that you want to work towards or the exercises that you want to raise the weight in and speaking of raising the weight if you want to improve your grip strength you just lift heavy things honestly it's just that simple start doing things like heavy deadlifts rack pulls shrugs farmer carries you know especially farmer carries that's got to be one of the best exercise you can do to improve your grip strength as soon as i started training strongman my grip strength just shot up because it's practical you know it's functional it's like real life situations that's why strongman training improves your grip so much because you have to carry these odd objects and that's that's just like real life you come into these scenarios where you're going to be challenged your grip is going to be challenged your balance you know your stability these are all factors in how long you're able to hold something that being said, you can improve your grip strength outside of the gym as well, you know? That's just like carrying a little bit more extra groceries at one time from your vehicle to your house. Or that's just, you know, it's it's taking the, the long road, you know? It's it's asking people if they need help moving. It's, it's taking the steps instead of the elevator. It's all these other little day-to-day -day things because your grip strength builds up every time that you're holding something that's challenging you. So the more times that you take up these opportunities to challenge yourself, the more your grip's gonna improve. So just because something's harder doesn't mean that you should stray from it or try and find an easier way. Sometimes that means deliberately taking the hard road, taking the hard way, trying to carry things in as few trips as possible or offering to carry the heavy end of a piece of furniture. It's all these little opportunities and decisions you make that ultimately build up your grip strength. So yeah, the exercises that I've been showing in this video are all very good grip builders, for sure, 100%. But if you really want to build up your grip strength, then take up those opportunities in your day-to-day -day life, take the harder road, challenge yourself, and mostly lift heavy things. 
And just a last quick point before we wrap up the video, this also means in the gym, avoiding using things like chalk, lifting straps, anything that assists your lift. So don't deadlift with a reverse grip. If you're trying to build up your grip strength, deadlift with a standard double overhand grip because it's harder to hold the bar that way. When you're carrying things up and about your life, don't wear gloves, you know? Try and build up some calluses and, and try and build up some raw grip strength. All right, that's gonna do it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. And if you haven't yet, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. That would really help me grow. Klaus next out.